right, so we're here at Andrew Jackson's Hermitage. Uh, this is where he lived. This is his whole grounds. Uh, just did a uh, like 15 minute movie about his life. Very interesting guy. I think he's one of my favorite presidents. Minus a few things. Nobody's perfect. But um, this whole grounds is absolutely gorgeous. The skies, they're overcasty. Overcast skies. Thundering a little bit. Cool atmosphere though. And at least it's not like hot. They gave me this, uh, did I lose it? Oh, here it is. This thing, it's like a TI-83 calculator and an MP3 player in one. And uh, you can listen, you can listen to, um, you listen to different things, like right here. I can hit 105, and it will tell me about Andrew Jackson. If I hit 205, it's a kid's version. I, I would I would probably understand the kid's version much better. As you walk this path, you're approaching the hermitage nearly the same way visitors did in Andrew Jackson's day. Some had traveled for hours by carriage or horseback, others even longer on foot. No matter who they were, they knew they would be welcome. One visitor explained. No person of respectability visited that part of the country without making a call upon the general. He kept open doors. Um, we do have the original tulip poplar flooring all throughout the home. And um, to kind of keep that safe, we put some great commercial carpeting on top of that. <laughs> the best shots I've ever gotten in any house ever you're not allowed to film in there and I was like halfway through and the guy goes hey you can't film anymore I'm like well look I came here to film I gotta test this camera out and that's what I'm gonna do I didn't say any of that to him but I did like hide the camera like in my hands and I was just like do, 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 click turn it off do, 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 turn it back on I was, whatever I'm outside now they can't yell at me so a lot of the house has been like the house originally burnt down and they rebuilt it to this but then it's been like rebuilt three more times. It's just one of those things where like you're gonna go see history and then you step into it and you find out something was just repainted last week and then something else has been from the 60s. It's like, what's the point? But Andrew Jackson, did you even touch this thing, bro? The museum had more old stuff. <laughs> in and it's so clear this thing is it fits in my hand like the width of my hand this thing look at these like birds over here what are these vultures check out these vultures halfway there those weren't vultures these ladies I just heard them saying they're wild turkeys Clearly, I'm not cultured enough. I've been around a lot of wild turkeys the past couple of years. I don't know why I have, but I have. And I should have known a wild turkey when I've seen one. Found a little creaky trail with some whitewater rapids in it. it up 
Oh, Andrew Jackson's Hermitage. Hermitage. I did get a I, I am a sucker. A s sucker for hats. And I heard this quote in the movie. And, uh, you, I, you know, you watch a little film before you go do the tour. They said it. Andrew Jackson said it, and then the, the reenactor said it. I was born for a storm, and a calm does not suit me. It's an old man hat, but I think it's dope. I was born for a storm, and the calm does not suit me. Arr.